Right up, morning guys, welcome to today's video. I'm just sitting here, minding my own business. Not, whoa, not playing with a dragon. Some of you guys wanted an update. So I'm gonna update you on Miss Trixie. Here she is. Oh, she's like, don't, don't show me. She's doing good, she's perfect in every way. She's almost the perfect weight. Anyway, here's Trixie. She says, good morning and welcome to the vlog. We have a really busy day. A crappy day it's wet outside it rained all night I didn't get to say good night to my chickens I didn't get to spend time with them yesterday I've been letting them out for hours at night and just hanging out with them I didn't get to do any of that but today's a new day and we are headed off to the barn we have a lot to do it's show week and um, I'm excited about today even though yesterday was so crap I'm excited about today. It's new and I want that for all of you guys too. Go out there and be excited. Find the mini miracles. You can never tell if the day is going to be good or if the day is going to be bad unless you get out there and you live it. We are at the barn. Get our horses. We're not riding today even though we need to ride. It's been since Friday and today's Tuesday um, because one, our lessons were canceled for this week. Well, our le so one lesson was canceled because of the rain yesterday, and then uh, Gabby's lessons, pre-show lessons. Well, I rode yesterday. Are rescheduled, yeah. Sophie did ride a little bit yesterday. Sophie can't ride because she's got blisters. Let's show them. So I've been spraying them with lanocaine. Oh, can you not check the other one? This is, I don't know. You can't see the blisters in the sun. Oh, I can see them. Put it down. Oh, goodness sake. So she can't ride because you need arms to ride. And then Gabby is uh, just doing like show prep stuff. Like we're just here to do our horses feed and clean them up and bring them out of the paddock and spend a little bit of time with them. And then tomorrow we'll be back to normal. So here's the new grain for Chance. And it looks like this. I mean, so that's what it looks like. I wanna feel it. Yeah, it feels neat. All right, we got Mr. Magoo here, and I'm painting his feet with hardener, with like stuff. I have this antibacterial spray that I showed you guys before that I spray, and then we have special stuff that we paint their feet with to harden them up. Hi. Yeah, so we decided to just stay in this barn because we're not going to be here that long, and it's just, this barn's closer to both of their fields, so we decided to stay here. Ago, she did not find her phone or camera. Yeah, two minutes ago, I couldn't find anything. But I'm excited. So, anyway, if you've been thinking that our horse footage has been shorter than normal, it's because I'm obsessed with our chickens. So I have lunch, <laughs> lunch for them, and I put up this whole fencing system. Yeah, I should put it over there where it's shady. I've become so obsessed since we got the silkies. I love them. They can get out, right? They are the perfect chickens. Oh yeah when we went to the barn today to take care of our horses and so when we went there their chickens were free ranging and they all ran up to us it's my favorite and i've been working so hard at getting my chickens to come to me and they do now they and do like yesterday. no i'm obsessed with them and i'm obsessed with them free ranging but i'm not obsessed enough to not be scared of losing one to me free range and losing even one chicken is enough for me not to free range them. It's just not my thing. I am too nervous of a person to do that. But instead, I set up this big area and we are gonna free range our little chickens. Like and the, they are, they know. <laughs> he can tell Did our excitement. <laughs> no, I let, okay, just wait, listen. So a couple days ago, I let the silkies out here and the other chickens were freaking out. Was this set up though? No. But anyways, the rooster, did you hear him just scream at the top of his lungs? Yeah, he didn't even do a crow. He just... Alright, come on. We, we still don't know if that's a rooster or a hen. They're afraid. I hope it's a hen because it has giant cheeks. Yeah, it's so cute. Anyway, they're afraid. Oh, here they come. Hi, Chipmunk. Here they come. Come on. They're coming! It's happening! Until we have to chase them around the yard to get them back. Yeah, that will be a problem. But they're coming out. There we go. There we go. They're out. Whoa. <laughs>
So now that they're out, I have today's second meal of the day. I, I just been giving them so much food, you guys. I can't like help it. I'm just obsessed with it. So we make our meal every single day for our bearded dragon. And then while we're making that, I make a special meals for them. So this is hard boiled egg, some nectarines and some kale. So that's what they're getting today. Sometimes I give them frozen fruit. That's what I gave them this morning. And then at night I sometimes give them like some seeds. But they are loving it. So I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna feed them. Hello. Because I love doing it. Have some peaches. She says, okay, I'll have peaches. <laughs> now they all come. Oh, have some peaches and some kale. They like the peaches. Here. So Sophie and I are sitting out here with not a chicken in sight. They literally all just went back in their coop. But I got I got Spot here. Do you guys remember who Spot is? Spot is the boy. He's the little rooster of my silkies. I have two silkies. And I love him. He's probably hey, five and a half months old now. And I have one Silky. Yeah, one Silky is Sophie. Sorry. But anyways, I love him. He's so cute. He, I'll show you his ears. He's not happy about it. But look, hey, do you guys see his ears? Hey, get off Nelly. I can't see. <laughs> the rooster is mating with the other Silky and Sophie. Sophie screamed, hey, get off Millie. Get off my chicken. <laughs> But when roosters mate, did you guys know that all they do is they just touch their gland and it's not, not the kind of gland you're thinking, but they just touch a part of their body to the girl. Like they don't, there's no, there's, it's not any kind of, it's not like what you're thinking. It's easy. It's simple. It's, it's a lot less than what you think. I've learned to think of it differently when I see it now. Oh yes. I love you. Yum, 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 yum. Oh, you're so cute. So I have the two silkies and then the two frizzles. And they have like this this feather instead of fur, like regular. They have fur instead of feathers. You have one silky. I have one silky. But anyways, so I'm thinking that I'm probably going to bring them in. Like I have like a different area that I can bring them that's heated but still kind of outside. And I think, oh, he's so cuddly. I think I'm probably going to do that. Um, with them for the winter because I love them so much and because they can be like more heat sensitive cold sensitive I guess than a regular chicken. But I love her. I love him. I don't love him as much as I love her She's just the sweetest little chicken you could ever imagine, but this is what a silky is like like this is their personality Oh, yeah, do you hear him and sometimes I hold him and I rub his feet and he just lays there like because he's <laughs> so happy to have his feet rubbed. Right now I'm rubbing his chest. Yeah, you like it, don't you? See, you guys are seeing it now, right? Like, you get how people get obsessed with chickens. It's not just that they're like fun to watch and that they give eggs. They're like so sa satisfying. And they're fun to collect because you get all the different colors. But it's through trial and error you learn like what your favorite breeds are and my favorite breeds I knew it was going to be a silky and it is a silky like I if I only have silkies for the rest of my life I'd be happy. So do you guys remember when I said I dreamed of sitting over here in a swing watching the horses? Well Sophie and I are about are you to do that. On it? I have never sat on it. Sit Sam put on it. I'll video you. No because he used bungee cord. So I'm a bit worried. You no, sit on it. Things, I'm not sitting on it. I don't sit on these. Alright, hold on. Things. Let me sit. Well, do you want Molly on it first? Why? You think Molly needs to get on it? Get up there, Molly. Molly, go up. Go up. Whoa. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Whoa. Alright, well. It's on a I'm bungee. Scared. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared too. Oh, it's so nice. It's nice. Until it breaks, it's the oh my god. That's it's so close to the ground. <laughs> it's scary. I'm afraid. I'm afraid to sit on it. Does it look safe, you guys? Whenever you try something new, don't take somebody who's a chicken with you. I love it. I can feel my bum touching the ground now. Stretched it a bit. So Sam said he's gonna get better rope. But I like it. That's cute. Stay. Molly. Hey, go. Look at me. Woo! What? 
Jesus. This would be fun though. Like, wait. Yeah, once we get the rope on there, this is gonna be fun as heck. I am. I love it. Penny and I are so good at taking horses out all by ourselves. You do it. <laughs> taking my horse out. Come on, I'll help you. So this is Willow and Sophie for tomorrow. Three, seven poles. I think she should make it all the way down to the end of the arena. No, that way. No. Seven poles all in a row. You guys think Willow can do it? Well, if Molly can do it, I think Willow can do it. <laughs> One last look at Sophie's sunburn. I'm almost thinking like she got into that wild mustard or what's that plant that pokes you no if you get it on you it makes you get blistered it's i did not even touch okay my lips. turn around oh nope you can just see little tiny baby blisters see like that's that rash. such a big relief though don't press on my shoulder sorry don't but then i love this shirt okay so look at this side this is what it was concerning me this morning was that it didn't look like this before. Oh, what? Do you guys see it? What the heck? Yeah. I can't it's, even see it because my nose is in the way. It's like a lot of blisters and some of them Don't are touch big. It. Like, she doesn't even look this red. Looks less than this side. She hardly looks red and that's what's weird about it. Like, look at her arms. Like, you can hardly, like, even well, her face isn't like, red. It's only on my shoulders. I know, it's weird. 